After a handful of celebrity parents were caught up in a massive college admission scandal, there's been a renewed focus on extreme parenting techniques, including something called snowplow parenting, a trend in which parents go to great lengths to shield even their adult children from life's obstacles. Here to comment, please welcome one of my writers, Dina Gusovsky. As a native Russian and a child of immigrants, I think this whole idea of snowplow parenting is absolutely insane. Which brings me to a new segment called, Everyone Should Be Raised by Immigrants. <laughs> Look, growing up is hard, but immigrant parents make it even harder. They don't snowplow. If anything, they bury you in snow and give you a tiny shovel to dig yourself out. <laughs> you know, to build character. Now, I came to America when I was four, and one of my first memories here was my parents sending me off without warning to the horror that is kindergarten. Oh. I remember kindergarten being fun and easy. For you, I'm sure it was, but I did not speak English, and no one there spoke Russian. Oh, yeah, that's different. <laughs> well, Seth, that was the least of it, because my parents also wanted to make sure that I was not underdressed for my big day. So they sent me to school in what they assumed all Americans send their kids to school in, a tuxedo and a top hat. <laughs> That's right. I had to explain to the other children in broken English that I was indeed their classmate <laughs> and not a tiny cruise ship magician. <laughs> but that taught me to fend for myself very early on. I mean, that's rough. It's adorable, but it's rough. And if you think that's bad, as you get older, immigrant parents are constantly reminding you how much better you could have been, how much more you should have done, and how Svetlana's daughter is going to Harvard when she is only 12 years old. <laughs> they always bring up Svetlana when they want you to feel bad. I'm sorry, is Svetlana your mother's friend? She says Svetlana's real, but no one knows for sure. Like a Russian Santa. <laughs> Seth, I read an article that said some American parents let their kids come home from college because they didn't like their roommates. You think living with a college roommate is hard? Try living with an immigrant mother. No matter how bad your college roommate is, they're not going to keep weak old veal tongue in the fridge. <laughs> and they certainly wouldn't ask every date you bring back to the dorm when he intends to propose. <laughs> Do you know that she is already 20? Her ovaries will not last forever. <laughs> Seth, it may seem like it's tough to be raised by immigrants, but they're just trying to prepare you for the real world. They would never embarrass you by getting arrested like some of these celebrity snowplow parents, but they will embarrass you by putting you in a top hat and a tux. This has been Everyone Should Be Raised by Immigrants. Dina Gustafsky, everybody!